I'm addicted to adventure. Several times a month, I pack my things and escape the city. I'll never forget about the year 2022. This is when gas prices were at their all-time high. Fuel cost was about doubled compared to the year before. One thing about being addicted to something is you find a way to get your fix. I find peace when I'm on an adventure. I know that sounds weird. This was a really noisy night. I find comfort in being uncomfortable and knowing that I could get myself or help a friend get out of a bad situation. 2022 is the year that my vehicle received a lot of upgrades. These treks to USA rock sliders played a big part in protecting my ride this year. Sitting lonely in my room again I'm Trying to find the words to say But nothing comes out I am looking for the better day It seems like they just stay away Whenever I try There's so many things that I keep in my mind My friends keep me out And it hurts every time With all the emotions I built up inside Oh, why can't I? Will someone look for me if I disappear? No matter how much that I scream, nobody hears. But I see the light from far away, it's down the line. Maybe I should not give up without a fight. Cause there will be a time. Twenty twenty two is the year that I finally opened up to the idea of running a rooftop tent. And now there's just no going back. The rooftop tent is very spacious, and it's a great place to hang out for hours upon hours.
I like the idea of a hard shell rooftop tent. Just unbuckle a few straps, pop it up, and within about 15 seconds, you're good to go. You don't need a reservation. You don't have to spend a bunch of money. You just go. Are the mountains calling? Well, just go. Is this creek whispering your name? Well, perfect time to go. Fingers stained with blood Been grasping all day Losing my touch with reality Driving all day Searching all night Can't seem to focus this double sight This is a tale Sworn in a sight Yeah, if you look in the distance, there's a hole in the wall back there. Oh, oh yeah. wow. I'm so cold. Yeah, my heart's sinking like a stone.
train. <laughs> Teleport me home to my king bed. <laughs> <laughs> it. This is how oh, wildfires are started. Oh, you have to pull <laughs> underneath your butt? Yes. <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> This was my third trip out to the Mojave Road. I actually tried to secure permits just like last year, but according to the Mojave National Preserve, they wanted thousands of dollars to chaperone us. And so we had to improvise. What we did was we split up into groups of seven vehicles each and made sure that we kept separate from each other the entire trip. Hey, excuse me, do you guys have a permit? I, I'm counting eight vehicles here. Oh wait, we're missing one. We picked up the Xterra. Bring the Bronco over.
Good job. Try to go a little faster. All right, cool. Okay, keep this way. Keep driver. Keep driver. It's really deep over there. Oh, really? Jeez. Okay. This video is an eclectic compilation of all the beautiful places I visited in the year 2022. It's also a reminder that I met some pretty amazing people this year. This is Pat and Emma, and they have an interesting story, one that would resonate with a lot of people. So they're used to staying at developed campsites at all the different national parks. Sometimes it's impossible to make a reservation and plan ahead. Sometimes you have to book three months in advance. On the day the campsite's open, within minutes, those campsites are taken. So they took it upon themselves to build out one of the most off-road capable vehicles from the factory, a Ram Power Wagon. Now they can stay on public lands, away from the crowds, and without reservation. Now they're overlanders. I use my overland rig to travel and do things that I love to do, like go snowboarding, go on a hike. This is a lifestyle. I'm able to do more of these things because it doesn't cost me anything to stay in public land. And how could you beat views like this? Sun is shining on us right now. Oh, Look at that. Yeah. Look at that. It's God, even... is, God is shining on us right now. God is. Oh, Lordy. Oh, Lordy, Lord. Lord. Lord.
Hey guys! When most people think of Moab, they think of fins and things, Hell's Revenge, and Poison Spider. But did you know there's a softer side? Easy and moderate difficulty trails do exist in the off-road mecca. This is the perfect plan to come at this time. Oh, yeah. It's like an amphitheater. 
Oh, yeah. Amphitheater. That was the word I was thinking of, Jordan. Yeah. Just Not have like price. someone. Right down there. Yeah. Well, you, have a, you can set up a band under the arch. Yeah. You're here all day. You're really good. 20 bucks a shot. Oh, there we go. <laughs> 2022 is the year that I met renowned Honda tuner Emmanuel, otherwise known as Eman. He's held the record for fastest Civic Type R in North America, which includes Canada and Puerto Rico. He implemented technology that he uses on the drag strip and added line lockers to the midsize Hondas with a clutch pack in the center, twin clutch packs in the rear. You only have to fix the front open differential to add a locker effect. This gave me some peace of mind when I went on a solo adventure with the wife. The system is called Balls, otherwise known as Break Aid Line Lock System. It's just another tool to help get me a little further or get me out of trouble. Modifications could only do so much, and trying to get through this section seemed a bit risky, especially with my wife with me. I didn't want to put her into any unnecessary danger. All right, time to back up. All right, so we're now set up over here in Lytle Creek. We are pretty close to home. I think about like 50 miles away from home. Camera shy. Or babe, are you being camera shy? It's just another doorway to open up and see. The old kind of lifeline will be waiting there for me. I need to bury all these fears.
The thing that made this Colorado trip so special was Carrie's attempt to climb up Imogene Bass in her Subaru. It's never been video documented before, so we give it a try, and she almost made it up. And Carrie would then go on to compete in the all-women's rebel rally, where she had a podium finish. After three week-long trips to Utah, the Grand Canyon, and Colorado, I decided to take August off from the adventures. At the time, I worked a 100% commission-based job, and I was able to set my own schedule. But I can't generate income if I'm out on my adventures. I know many of you think that I do YouTube full-time, and I find that very flattering. I appreciate it. But this is a hobby of mine, one that I enjoy very much. So I appreciate you watching. With the substantial suspension modifications from any performance, the Honda flexes so much more. Check to see if a wheel ever gets in the air.
Oh wow. Yeah, there you go. I was gonna try a modified line, but as you can see, um, not gonna work. So <laughs> I've ended my front buffer right there. I also think that if I straddle this side too much, then it's I, I won't have enough clearance. So I just kind of have to drive on over that that bigger rock right there. And there you go. I think right there. Right there and then bring him up. Keep going back a little bit more. Start turning past him. Right there. Now just cut it past him. Your passenger tires right here, look. This is what we want, okay? You're gonna have to lock your driver. Go all the way back. Let's, let's reset you completely. We're gonna get you up. He's just nervous. We got him though. So keep in mind, this is really difficult terrain. We're getting John up. Uh, it's something that not too many people will attempt in the platforms like this. But of course, we're used to the lines. We can choose them. We'll get them up. We just gotta work past his nerves. And he's gonna do some rad shit today. Back up. Keep going slowly. Keep going slowly. You're good.
I'm alone, I'm a broken home. I gave you all the bricks that I own and know. I'm letting go, I'm breaking these walls down, breaking these walls down. If you want it, then fight at fight a home. But if you want to travel, then go alone. Yeah, what's the point in us if I never know? Yeah, if you're gonna leave, I'ma let you go. I'm tired of the pain Go away I'm tired of the If you got this far, thank you very much for watching and the support. I really appreciate it. I hope that compilation inspires you and captivates your imagination. I hope it opens up your mind on the way you could travel and the lifestyle that this offers. Some people call it overlanding. Some people call it adventure travel or car camping. Whatever it is, your vehicle and traveling this way could provide that self-sufficiency to get you out there, to do the things you love to do. This lifestyle could be a catalyst for change. Make sure to take care of your mental health and your physical well-being. I wish you a healthy and prosperous year 2023. And I hope you have fun on your adventures. My year 2023 is off to an adventurous start, and I can't wait to share this snow adventure with you all. This will be the next episode, and sorry, this compilation took so long to create. It took nearly two weeks between having to work a full-time job, 
and actually getting out on adventures. So thank you very much for the patience and support and stay tuned. Till next time, take care.